XP Protection Center, um, which comes from XP Protection Dash Center dot com. It is not a Microsoft uh, program. It is called XP Protection Center. It is a Roic program. Do not buy a license for it. Do not download it. Um, and if you happen to get it on the computer, um, I'm going to show you how you can remove it. And you don't have to worry about those annoying pop-ups anymore. Um, this is what it looks like. Um, gives you false results. Um, well, you want to go to malwarebytes.org. And you want to come down here and you want to click download now. Then you want to come back and you want to click download now again. Now you want to save the setup. Save the setup and you want to install it. Um, now when you get to the end of it, it will it will have a place to check marks which will to update it to the latest definition files and to open the program so you would be this is what it looks like and and once you use this if you use this another time you always want to go to the update tab and then click the check for updates button um but um to get remove XP Protection Center, you want to perform a quick scan, and you can come down here and click scan. And scans do take a while, um, so you just want to start it and go do something and come back. Uh, so it's finished or whatever. And once it gets finished, it will come up as road dot XP Protection Center. And it will show the registry files, file names, and all that stuff. You want to remove any of that stuff that comes up that is infected. And if you continue to see annoying pop-ups or um, any other type of programs like XP Protection Center, and you continue to see symptoms, you want to perform a full scan. And it will take um, a whole lot longer to do a full scan. Um, but the next program I would like you to get is go to Super Anti Spyware. You want to come down here and click Download Now. And then you want to scroll down and you want to click Download Free Version Home Users. It's going to come up to save it. You want to save the setup and install it. Now once you install it, you want to open it up. And if you use this besides this day, say you use it tomorrow, the next day, whenever, a few days, whenever you're going to use a uh, super anti-spyware, it's a good spyware tool program to have. Um, you want to always check for updates. Click the check for update button update buttons um click to check for updates um but um you want to click scan your computer and you just want to perform a quick scan and this will uh, find any spyware stuff advertising stuff and you just want to remove that stuff that comes up it gets cookies too and all that stuff it's a good program um if you want to thoroughly check your computer, you can do it. Complete a quick scan. The next thing I'd like you to get is ATF Cleaner. I'm going to have the link, this link right here to download it. It is just the program. Um, it is a nice little program to have. Uh, you don't need to install it. It's the program itself. You want to open it up. Um, just click select all and click empty selected. Now this works for XP, um, Windows 2000, and Vista. You have to run it on administrator. Um, it's a good program to have. Um, the next thing I'd like you to download is CCleaner from CCleaner.com.
you want to come over here and click download CCleaner now come down here and click come down here and click download from file hippo and then come up here and click download latest version and you just wanna save the setup to your computer and when you want to do a custom install and do not install the Yahoo toolbar and once you have installed it and opened it up uh, it looks like this right here um, just come on down here to the registry part you want to click registry and you want to click scan for issues and you want to do click fix selected issues it ask you to back up your registry I recommend yes um, but if you want to click no you can click no and uh, then it'll find your problems and then you click fix all selected issues and it will fix what they recommend they're gonna do which is probably delete it um, see cleaner it's a good program to have and I will have alternative links if you cannot download um, our bytes or any of these other programs that I showed you and if you have any questions message me um, leave me comments and please subscribe because I got a whole lot more videos I'm going to be making there's a lot of um, world programs I have and I'm going to be showing you them so please subscribe and as always thanks for watching